Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today with some Series 13 LEGO minifigure pack openings. These are my very first Series 13 minifigures and I'm very excited for them. Here we'll just set these two down and take a quick look at the packages. Yes, I have sliced them open just so it's easier to open them in this review. But here's what the package looks like. Some of the best minifigures on the front. One minifigure, Series 13, 16 to collect. And then here on the back here it says collect and win. Because each figure, I'm guessing you get like a code in this little sheet for to win prizes. So that is pretty cool. So now we're just going to dump these figures' contents out. Slide that back in here. And we have the Fencer. Awesome. This is one of my actually favorite figures in this series. I love the Hot Dog Man. Everybody's obsessing over the Unicorn Girl and... As of right now, she's a cool figure, but not one of my favorites. So if I get her, it doesn't really matter. Here's the Fencer. This is a very cool figure. We'll just take his head off. That's what he looks like. He's got, you know, front printing, back printing, uh, no back printing, but front printing, pants printing, and the, this really cool fencing sword. And I like how they have the two, one minifigure hand in yellow and one minifigure hand in white to represent him wearing a glove. Figure number one, we'll go to the next figure now. Whatever that might be. Oh, it's the space guys. This is a cool figure. Build him up here. He's all blue and he has lots of printing. This is actually very similar to my very first Lego minifigure that I received ever, or not received, but purchased for myself. It was that Series 3 Space Guy. Oh, this is the same gun as the Lego Movie Guns, I think. Pretty sure they're the same. And does this radar dish go on? I think like that. So very cool figure. We'll zoom in here on him. He's got like a mutant face, like little, like, te I don't know what they are. Tentacles, I think they're called. And he's got a, a ray gun with a blaster on the end. He's got really cool front printing and really cool back printing. And he's all like lime green very cool minifigure. We'll zoom out here and we'll take a look at the very last minifigure that we got. Which will it be? No, it's not the hot dog guy. No, it's not the Egyptian guy. No, it's not the Burger King. But it is this awesome figure. Those the, those are some of the favorite, my favorite minifigures and unfortunately I did not get them this time around, but I will. This is a very, very cool minifigure. I love the samurai women. And I don't think there's a figure like that out yet. I'm trying to look, but I have all my other figures taken down. Nope. There's a samurai man, I know, but I don't know if there's a samurai woman. I think she puts her swords on like this. I think. Who knows? I don't know. You don't know. Maybe you do know. Maybe I know, I'm just not telling you. So this is very cool, we'll zoom in on her. She holds, has her two swords, and they're in metallic silver, I believe the cut's the color. She's got some body armor on the front with some nice shoulder pads, pants printing. She, uh, I can't tell if she has free, she has torso printing, which you saw a minute ago. I don't know if she has torso back printing, but it doesn't really matter, you never see it. She's got the arg head with only one side of a head, and she's got her hair all up in a bun, so she can fight. So thank you so much for watching these three Lego series minifigures, whatever you call them, 13 openings. I got some three, I got three really awesome figures that I'm glad I did get. I hope to get several more before this series is out, probably in May. That's when they're done. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you have a great day.